What's up guys? Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video I'm gonna show you how to create a product details page for a food delivery app. First I'm gonna create an artboard. I'm using iPhone 6, 7, 8 plus artboard. Then I'm gonna place the left arrow to the top left corner of the artboard. After that I'm gonna place the product image to the top of the artboard. Then I will increase the height and width of the product image to 268 pixels. Then I will use the rectangle tool to create a rectangle. Next I will remove its border, and I will change the top right border radius and top left border radius to 15 pixels. Next I'm gonna add a drop shadow to the rectangle. After that I'm gonna grab the rectangle tool and create a rectangle of width 119 pixels and height 54 pixels. Now I'm gonna change the border radius to 27 pixels and I will align it to the center. Let's remove the border and fill it with a color. The color code I'm using here is hash F, F, C, 100. Next I'm gonna add a light yellow drop shadow to it. We are using this as the quantity selector button. Next I will add a number and plus and minus sign to it. I will change the font color to white and I will keep the font size to 24 pixels. Next I'm gonna use the text tool to create the product title. I'm gonna change the font color to hash 1D1D1D. Then I will change the font size to 24 pixels and font weight to bold. Next I'm gonna create restaurant title. The font color I will be using is hash 6E6E6E and font size will be 16 pixels. And I will keep the font weight to regular. Then I will place the rating stars. Next I will add the details of the product. For that I will create a title with the text, details. I'm gonna reduce the font size to 18 pixels. Next I will create a text layer and paste the content for the product details. I will change the font size to 18 pixels and, font weight to regular. And I will change the color to hash, FFC100. Next I'm gonna create the price. For that I will add the dollar sign with a font size of 16 pixels. Now I will create the amount, then I will change the font color to hash 1D1D1D. And font size to 25 pixel, after that I will change the font weight to bold. Now I'm gonna change the color of the dollar sign. The color code I'm using here is hash F, F, C, 100. Next I'm gonna create the add to cart button. For that I'm gonna use the rectangle tool and create a rectangle. Next I'm gonna change the border radius to 34 pixels. Then I will remove its border and fill it with the color. Same as the quantity selector button. Then I will add the, add to cart, text on top of the button. I will change the font color to hash 131313, and I'm gonna change the font size to 18 pixels and font weight to bold. There you have it guys. If you find this tutorial helpful please like, comment and subscribe. See you in the next video.